British pro-Kremlin blogger Graham Phillips is shooting a video. Behind him, three T-72 B-3 tanks. Russia's upgraded version of the T-72. Equipped with a new firing system and Belarusian Sosna U sights with thermal imager. In use by Russia since 2012, it was never supplied to Ukraine. The first T-72B-3 was hit by Ukrainian forces in 2014. Here's the Sosna U site. A Ukrainian separatist TV channel reports on large-scale exercises organized by separatist authorities. The pictures show a BPM-97 armoured personnel carrier. The BPM-97 is a Russian light armoured vehicle. Modified versions were called Vistrel and Dazor. It was never supplied to Ukraine. Проходит колонна современных разведывательно-патрульных машин Дозор. Separatist fighters show data to OSCE observers. They're using an Istyonok mobile radar system, which can locate enemy mortars and artillery. First made in Russia in 2008, it was never supplied to Ukraine. This is the Pantsir S-1, a Russian surface-to-air missile system for shooting down aircraft, helicopters and missiles. It was never supplied to Ukraine. Колонну зенитных ракетно-пушечных комплексов «Панцирь-С» возглавляет капитан Иван Большаков. Комплекс «Панцирь» производят в городе Герои Тули, столице русского оружия. В ходе учений он доказал свою эффективность. 